For this video, we are going to help this noob reach second C using the spine of food. What, but gamer nom, this is update 2.17. I think you're at update 2.5, something like that. This is just the intro. Don't worry, I did the video at update 2.51. So before we start, guys, you can show your support by using star code gamer nom when purchasing Robux. So that's it for the introduction. Are you ready, guys? Let's go. Where the actor slam. Oh, there it is. Forward. There's your slam. There's the dump. Yellow. Gamer Nom is back. So we're gonna start, guys, by doing the chicken quest. So you're gonna find three chicken, fried chicken. So here are the locations. One here. At the gacha. There you go. And at the black market. So I'm gonna add something new here. So I'll let you decide. Would you rather eat chickens or start this quest, the soldier quest. So you need to defeat six. Use your Z skill to transform into a Spinosaurus. Just use your left click. There you go, and that's it. Defeat six. The goal here is to reach level 10. Again, you choose chicken quest or this quest. When you reach level 10, you can start defeating the clown pirates. So you need to defeat seven. There you go. Stat check, 40, powerful, and that's it. Use your left click, left click, left click. You need to defeat seven and you will level up, okay? Okay, so the goal here is to reach level 20. And when you reach level 20, you can start defeating Smokey. Okay, stat check 80 power foot. So far, you don't need to put stats on defense because whenever you transform, your HP increases. So here you go, just three left clicks and that's enough to defeat Smokey. Okay, so you're gonna do this until you reach level 30. Go after that, you can now proceed to Tashi. So you can see our power foot is 120. Now we can unlock a new skill, and that skill is the Roar. Let's check it out. So, Roar is one of the most important skills of a Spino Fruit user. It will be used later for farming, I'm gonna show it to you, but now you can survive by using left clicks, okay? Okay, so the goal here is to reach level 50. Defeating Tashi, you're gonna reach level 50, and after that, you can now proceed to the next island, the Pirate Island. Here, we can use the Roar. Okay, so first, five Clown Pirates. Just use your X skill. That's three Clown Pirates. Wait for them to spawn. Oh, stats. Put it all on the Power Foot. Okay, just use your X skill, and that's one quest. Okay, go here is to reach level 75. You can also use your left clicks if you want. So at 75, we can start defeating the Clown. Gamer Nom, until what level are we gonna defeat this clown? Guys, level 125. That is faster. Trust me, guys. Stay here until you reach level 125. Don't worry. Every single clown defeated is one level. Okay? Okay, so next island. Soldier Island at 120. Sorry, guys. It's 120. <laughs> Sorry, it's 120, not 125. So we're gonna start defeating the captain. Very easy to defeat. Just use your skills. No, I suggest don't use the roar. I'm just showing it to you. The goal here is to reach level 145. Okay, 145. And after that, you can go up here and start defeating the axe hand. Yes, the axe hand. So is it easy to defeat? Yes, easy to defeat. But before that, we've already unlocked our third skill, the terror roar. So this is a long range skill. Actually, not long range. Maybe mid range. Longer than the roar, but the damage is slower, okay? So how to make it faster? Defeat the Axe Hand, level up faster. Defeat the Captain, go back to the Axe Hand, and after that, defeat the Captain. So the goal here is to reach level 230, okay? Guys, 230, yes. We skip like two quests on our next island, why? Just trust me, guys, that is faster. Okay, so now, here in our boat, Next island is the Shark Island. So in this island, we're gonna defeat the Shark Man. Guys, check this mob out, Shark Man. If you defeat it, make sure to go back to the quest giver. Do your best to get the quest fast because this mob spawns really, really fast. Goal here is level 350, but before that, we will be unlocking the skill Scratch. So this is a this is the long range skill of this fruit, but again, the damage is so low. I don't like it. Again, the goal is 350. And when we reach level 350, we can now go to our next island. And that island is the Chef Ship. 
Actually, it's not an island. It's a ship. Sorry. Chef. Ship. There you go. Always a rowboat. Okay. So, at the chef ship, we're gonna start defeating the weapon man. But, gamer gnome, how about the dark leg? Guys, this fruit is so slow. We don't have, like, a skill to move faster. So, again, we decided to just focus on one enemy. One mob. Okay? One mob at a time. So here it is. Weapon man. So, the goal here is to reach level 450. 450, and after that, next island. The snow island. There we go. Okay. Again, 450, guys. So, at the snow island... We skip another quest, stat check first, 300 milli, put all your stats on the power food. And now we are ready to destroy the King Snow. So it really depends to you guys. If you want, you can use your left click, use your skills to make things kind of less boring. Look at the graphics, etc. Okay, so the goal here is to reach level four, 500, sorry, 500. When you reach level 500, you can now start defeating the Heavy Man. On the other side of this island, here you go, again 500. Heavy man, is it hard? No, it's easy. Goal here is to reach level 625. And before even reaching that level, we're gonna unlock the final skill, the beast mode. There you go, at 2000 power fruit. This will make you faster and will increase your damage. You can spawn this skill, to be honest. Okay? So uh, when you reach level 625, we can now proceed to this island, the desert island. We're gonna start with a bomb ban. 625 is easy to defeat. Gamer Nom, is there a faster way to level up here? Yes. Why 625? So that we can defeat two mobs simultaneously. So the Bomb Man. After that, you can go to the Candleman. After the Candleman, 100% Bomb Man already spawned. There you go. You're just gonna do this until you reach level 725. And after that, we're gonna start defeating the King of Snow. So is he hard to defeat? Yes. But if you're a Spinal Fruit user, then it will be easy. Okay, see that? Le three left clicks with the beast mode. So to make this faster, defeat the king of sand. There you go. And defeat the bomb man and go back to the king of sand. And that's it, guys. That's it. Goal here is to reach level 800. Okay? Level 800. So when we reach level 800, next up is the sky islands. The gamer room, can we jump here? That's why we uh, allotted some stats on the melee, right? 300, to make just to make sure. So we're gonna start here with the Sky Soldiers. You guys, check this out. Just one roar. One roar, one level up. That's really fast, right? Really fast. X, one level up. So the goal here is to reach level 1000, guys. Yes, no joke, level 1000. Follow me. With this strategy, and you will level up faster. Again, goal here is level 1000. There you go. After that, you can now go to the ball man. Don't forget to buy your hockey, observation hockey. So with the ball man, we're gonna level up until you reach level 1050. Guys, if you wanna get the pole, then fight the thunder god. But if not, guys, just leave him alone. <laughs> Fighting thunder god or rumble man is not the best way to level up. So again, level 1050. Or 1051, that's fine. We go. We're gonna go to the next island. And that next island is the Bubble Island. But before that, check this out, guys. Check that. Do you see that, guys? The dragon fruit user is waiting for us. There you go. He's gonna try and attack us. Okay. <laughs> nice try, bro. Okay. Go for it. You're almost done with the boat, the rowboat. So, yeah, he left me. Sad. Well, anyway, guys. Bubble Island, don't forget to get the Busu Haki here. We're gonna start with the soldiers, so just exit skill, wait for one to spawn, and that's it. That's one level. The goal with this is to reach level 1100, okay? Exit skill, wait for one to spawn, and that's it. So after this, our target is the leader. Their leader, guys. Okay. Here you go, he's easy to defeat. Is there a way to make things faster? Yes, after him, go back to the soldiers. Is your roar, defeat one, and go back to the leader. The goal here is to reach level 1150, and after that, you can start defeating Pasta. One of my favorite enemies, why? 
because he spawns really fast and he is easy to defeat. See that guys? After I defeat him, he's already there, meaning level up is faster. So the goal here guys is to reach level 1325. But guys, you can level up here until you reach level 1350. Okay, but I think 1325 is enough. Oh, there's a fruit guys, so let's offer it. Who wants rubber fruit? I leave it here in the bubble island near pasta, okay? Okay guys, so let's drop it here. Hope someone gets it. So guys, we are going now to our final grinding island, which is the lobby island. So why 1,325? Because we're gonna start here with the giraffe. See that guys? Next up, the wolf. So we're gonna defeat the giraffe, the wolf, the giraffe, the wolf, the giraffe, the wolf until we reach level 1,450. Yes. We can start with the Leo at 1,400, but again guys, that will be slower. The fastest way is to reach 1,450 with the Giraffe and the Wolf. Okay, okay, so when you reach level 1,450, you can now start defeating the Leo. So, guys, defeat Leo until you reach level 1,500 and that's it. That's the level requirement to go to the second C, okay? Okay, so at 1,500, you can now go to the War Island, Marine Ford. Okay, for those who don't know, this is the War Island. So you're gonna look for this traveler here. Okay, talk to him. He will ask you to look for a map. And that map is located here in the Fishland. Guys, you just need to defeat random mobs here. So with the use of the Roar, you can defeat lots of enemies at the same time to get the map okay. again don't get other quests the goal here is to reach sorry not reach is to get the map okay <laughs> so here it is the map and after that just return to the war island give it to the traveler he will thank you for that good luck and now you can go to the starting island okay. There go. Okay. yeah thank you okay now so at the starting island, you just need to talk to the elite pirate, guys, and that's it. He will send you to the second C. There you go. That's it for our video. Guys, request. Do you have requests? King Legacy video? Comment it on the comment section. To the Blocks Fruits fans out there, guys, don't worry. Control Fruit is coming out next. Again, to all the viewers, subscribers, supporters, I appreciate you all. This is GamerNom, and GamerNom out.